Hello, so today I'm making a banana chocolate raspberry cake. I don't really like banana cake, but we had a ton of overripe bananas. So this is the recipe for that, I guess. I peeled four of them into a separate bowl and not my big mixing bowl because I need that later and mashed them up with a fork, which took a lot longer than I thought it would. Maybe they weren't as overripe as... I thought. I then put that to the side and weighed out four ounces, yes I use old measurements, of butter, not really butter, it's stalk. Same thing, a bit different. Is it the same thing? Anyway, it works. That'll do. I then put in some sugar. I didn't put as much sugar as you'd usually put in. I only put two ounces because I know I'm putting jam in later. And I didn't want it to be overly sweet. This is a two egg cake. And here's the two eggs. As as you do. I kept the eggshell and banana peel to stick in the compost. And then I put some self-raising flour in. I put six ounces. I put more than you think you'd need. Because of the consistency of the banana and the jam that would be going in. Here's a banana. At this point I chose to dump all of that in and give it a good mix. I put three heaped tablespoons, dessert spoons, things of raspberry jam in there. I'm very precise with my measuring as you can tell. I then put a drizzle, and yes that's a technical term, of lemon juice to counteract the sweetness. I then got the correct tablespoon utensil out and put one and a half spoons of cocoa powder in. I then chopped some chocolate up, dark chocolate, baking dark chocolate. Listen, it would make more sense for me to have grated it, but I don't like using the grater because I tend to grate my hand. So I went for a knife because I don't tend to chop my finger off. Also, it's quicker. I'm an impatient person. I then dumped it all in the baking tray thing and cooked it for about 20 minutes. I then made the glaze, which was one spoonful of raspberry jam, a trickle of lemon juice and a squirt of syrup. Heated it in the microwave for 30 seconds and then drizzled it all over the cake 